Hello friends. Today, I will show you our new app, named Cupid Love. Now, let's open Cupid Love. Initially it will ask for location and notification permission. Now we can log in using Facebook or email. Now let's register new user from sign up page. Enter email as username. Enter first name. Last name. College or school name. Profession. Select birth date. Enter your password. Confirm your password. Select your gender, and click on sign up. Select your height. Religion. Ethnicity. Kids. Quote. Click next for continue registration process. You can upload photos from Facebook, gallery, or camera. Give permission to access gallery. You can select up to six photos. Click next to continue registration process. Now set date preference. And write something about yourself. Click on done to save preferences. Select interested gender, distance preference, and age preference. Click on submit to finish registration process. Now you have completed your registration process and reached to amazing part of our app. It's home page. Here, you can see members according to your preferences, and you can see their details, and images by scrolling them, and you can also like or dislike them. It's a match when user whom you like, likes you as well. Click on send a message to chat. If you are offline, then push notification of message is sent. By clicking on heart icon, you can send date request. Select place for date. Now select date and time. If that user accept your request for date, it will ask for permission to store reminder in calendar for the first time. After that all accepted request will be stored automatically. You can view mutual friends, if any, by clicking on mutual friends counter. From settings page, you can change your details, and preferences. Click on Done to save changes. You can accept, or decline date request. When someone likes you, you can check it, on notification page. You can check profile. Like, or dislike. You can remove advertisements from Cupid Love by purchasing it.
you can unmatch or block user from chat. From settings page, you can change images. Click on Logout. 